Lagos Chambers of Commerce and Industry held a quarterly press conference on Tuesday where it told newsmen its stand on economic issues such as the removal of the subsidy from the premium motor spirit, PMS. The recently signed revised 2020 budget, the adjustment of the exchange rate and more, Adibanke Oduni has the details. A press conference organized by the Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry, LCCI, many sundry economic issues were on the front burner. Addressing the media, the president of the chamber, while expressing concerns as regards non-compliance to the safety guidelines provided by the World Health Organization and the NCDC, noted and commended the recent adjustment of the exchange rate by the federal government to 381 naira per dollar. We are, however, troubled by the level of compliance by the populace to the safety protocols as laid down by the World Health Organization, the NCDC, and the specific guidelines that have been put in place by the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19. The Lagos Chamber notes the recent adjustment of the exchange rate, 360 naira to the dollar, to 381 naira to the dollar. This is a step in the right direction towards unifying the multiple exchange rates and improving transparency of the country's forex management. According to the Chamber, the removal of subsidy from the premium motor spirit, PMS, was commended, but however, it expressed concerns over the non-passage of the petroleum industry bill over the last decade. The Lagos Chamber of Commerce and Industry acknowledges the removal of the subsidy of Petroleum Motor Spirit, PMS, and sees it as a step in the right direction in rescuing this economy from further fiscal quantity. We are also deeply concerned that despite various reviews of the Petroleum Industry Bill, PIB, in the last decade, the bill is yet to be signed into law. The LCCI also commended President Mohamed Buhari on the signing of the revised 2020 budget, saying it would help in making up for lost time. First, we must acknowledge that the signing of the budget has come late, uh, and this is not the fault of government, because over time, the assumptions, underlying assumptions of the budget need to be adjusted severally because of the changing dynamics in the global oil market. The good thing is that when the president was assenting to the budget, he gave a directive that 50% of capital component of the budget must be released to all the MDAs before the end of this month. So we must commend the step that the president has taken. And we must also urge him and urge the, those in charge to ensure that this instruction is followed through. The LCCI commended and expressed concerns over a range of economic issues. The government is therefore urged to look into these issues for the good of its business environment. Reporting for Plus TV Africa, Adebanke Odunui.